Hello, this is Shep here at the Sun Valley Auto Club. In front of us today is a 1972 Chevrolet Suburban. It's a three-door Suburban, four-wheel drive. It's received a uh, total restoration. During that restoration, received a uh, nice upgrade as well. It now has the uh, 5.9 uh, Cummins turbo diesel in it. So powerhouse, it's got the additional Complete the look, give it the look. The uh, domed hood. So real sweet driving machine. It's got, that uh, 5.9 is mated to a 700 R4 uh, overdrive transmission. It's got a 12 inch rear end, solid axle. The front is a Dana 44 uh, front end with a disc, power disc brakes up front. Sitting on a three inch lift. We'll jump into the interior, but uh, it's a good point to, a uh, good spot to talk about the, uh, some of the interior. Did receive some interior and these running boards from, from uh, a Cadillac Escalade. So well put together in the sense that those puddle lights come right on. We'll finish with the exterior here. Imagine I'll go through it more than once, but a really quality paint job. It's seen some miles since restoration. So, you know, a few small dings or, or scratches, little chips. Shouldn't be too big of a surprise. There's one right there, but certainly no, no heavy damage, you know, throughout. Nice looking front end, nice paint. And with that paint as well, what I'm seeing is uh, just a quality job. You don't see uh, signs of poor prep as far as any sort of shrinkage on the clear coat, uh, orange peel. This was completed best guess about four years ago. So you've got plenty of time to, you know, have poor body work kind of come unwound so it's definitely proven the test of time no no cracking anywhere anything like that so jump back to the interior the interior did pick up uh the seats from a cadillac escalade so rather than just the seats being placed in there everything is hooked up and you've got all the the power, the lumbar that goes along with it. You've got the original door panels, door cards. Super groovy. Got good photos of the headliner, but the headliner's tight. No sagging or drooping as well. Center console from the same Escalade. A little hand belt portion right there all metal and you've got a screen this has Bluetooth in it we'll keep showing off the interior and we'll we'll go over more as we're doing the test drive but you have Bluetooth satellite radio uh, XM reverse camera navigation all in there as well so it is the three-door Puddle lights working on those running boards. So you've got a roll down window over there, but no door. But two captain's chairs. So seating for four, seat belts for four. And then as many kids as you can throw back there as you want. All right, I would do that, but I'm in Idaho. And my kids know to deal with it. But no seats back here. So best to consider this seating for four. But a lot of room. Front door just shut for us. That is a good sized tailgate coming down. A lot of room for gear, dogs, storage, etc. Spare tires there. Wood on the 
on the underside. I'll do underside photos. The metal's been treated. It's gorgeous. It's just like the rest of the car here. And that does have a nice firm latch to it. That door, you kind of got to pop. 